what's good everybody welcome in watch us on youtube or facebook you know what to do hit that like button if you watch on replay make sure you say replay down in the chat below we are shipping out yesterday's orders um so i would have a lot more orders to ship out but you'll see over the next week i'm going to be shipping throughout the day so the mornings i'll have less orders than i typically do um today i have four orders from ebay poshmark and mercari i have five from our six from whatnot, I believe. Um, yesterday I did ship out one, two, three, four, five orders in the middle of the day. So technically I would have had nine, but I'm trying to get orders out ASAP so people can get them early because obviously people have Christmas presents and stuff. So the next week you guys won't see a ton of orders from me because I'm gonna be shipping all throughout the day. That's okay, that means we can hang out and talk. What's up, Lily? What's up, Trisha? We still got a good amount of orders. I think I have, how many do I have for whatnot? I think it's five or six. Hold on. Appreciate everybody coming out for uh, yesterday's show as well. Let me set this up real quick. Shipments, I probably won't ship my whatnot orders on live. <clears throat> Why are you awake? Because I need to be awake, Chris. What are you talking about? I have uh, eight, no, five five pending shipments. What are you doing? I'm, I'm hanging out with you today, Felix. Did you ship your pants? I did. What's up, Emily? Emily, the only normal person. Emily and Bobby, the only normal people in this chat right now. <laughs> Appreciate you guys hopping on in. <clears throat> Let me set uh, YouTube and Facebook up off to the right. It should be a nice, easy, quick shipping live. So normal people are weird. I agree. Um, Jareen? Is that how you say your name? Jareen, what's up? Welcome in. Um, I got to stop shipping my pants. Me too. It's like, uh, it's, a, it's an issue I have too. So they're my favorite Wayne is, oh, there's another one. There's another one. What's up, Melissa? Normal equals boring. Yes. Facts. Facts. All right. So we only have four orders packing up again. If you guys are just hopping in, I shipped out all my orders early yesterday. You'll see me do that over the next, uh, at least the next week. Cause I want to make sure people are getting their items ASAP. So if somebody buys something from me in two hours, I'm going to have it shipped out immediately and out for the post office close. Okay, sorry, I'm horrible with names. Um, I'm gonna have it shipped out early for the post office, have them grab it and ship it. That's what you guys should be doing too. Ship out your stuff quick because people are buying Christmas gifts. The quicker you can get it there, the better feedback you're gonna get, all that good stuff. So no, they're they're normal, they're, they're normal. Um, did you give Trisha her drink back? No, I drank her drink. Her drink is drank and gone. <laughs> Cheers, Trisha. All right, um, let's start with Oh, so we only have two Poshmark, two eBay. No Mercari, but I did just get an offer on Mercari, so I'll probably accept that right after this live. And like I said, I'm gonna ship that bad boy out um, quickly. You didn't pin that? I know who pinned it, but you probably told them to pin it, so you still get in trouble. All right, first sale is a good one. All, the, all these sales are pretty good, actually. Even though they're four, they're four mighty sales. Um, this is a Bonobos blazer. This is one of the moon fabric blazers. You always look out for these. Go inside the pockets and look for Bonobos. And on the other side, look for the moon, the moon um, um, patch. Those are good blazers. Um, I picked this up for $8.03 and it sold in less than a month for 80 bucks. So after fee shipping cost of goods on Poshmark, I made a profit of $55.97. And these are super easy to ship out on Poshmark. I'm just going to grab a medium flat rate box and I'm going to stick it in there and I'm going to ship it out. That's how easy it is to ship. Easy peasy. Uh, you are a troublemaker. Appreciate the chili, Chris. You are a troublemaker. All right. I'm just going to seal it up like that, ship it out. It fits in here like a glove, so it should get there in one piece. And again, look out for those blazers. Um, J. Crew, Bonobos. Um, and I think there's another brand you look out for for the moon um, patch. They're always good and they always sell for good money. So you'd be proud of me. I just sold a pair of denim and supply jeans for $40 that I bought for three. I am proud of you. That's awesome, Amy. Let's go. Paid three, sold for 40 margins right there, people. Margins. What's up, Thrifty Goose? All right, that one shipped. Next up is an item that we just listed yesterday and it sold immediately, um, but it was after the mailman had already come. So that's why I didn't ship it yesterday. Where is it at? Where is it at? Oh, there it is. So this was, we. I listed this around three. The mailman had already came around two. So when they bought this, I couldn't ship it out that day. 
But this is a Polo Ralph Lauren turtleneck sweater. It's brand new with tags. I paid $8 for it in bulk buy. Sold for $42 bucks after fees, shipping, cost of goods. I make $26.60. I'll be watching Chris at peak right now, but he doesn't love us anymore. Yeah. Wah, wah, wah. Where'd you get the tag? Um, where'd... Where did you get the tag show wooden hanger? That wooden hanger is from Trisha Smith 86, who's in the chat right now, if that's what you're asking. She makes, her husband makes those hangers and they should have more released here pretty soon. Um, this is a Poshmark sale, so this is just gonna go right into one of these Tyvek envelopes. Remember on Poshmark, you can use any priority mail shipping um, supply. So that's why I was able to use that medium flat rate box because they don't care. You can use any priority mail shipping supplies as long as it's not prior priority mail express. You can't use those. Any regular priority mail shipping supplies. Any flat rates, anything. That's going to seal up. I'm going to throw a piece of tape on this and I've already printed out my label. So I just slapped the label on and it's good to go. Oh man, there's a Kayla hair in there. Kayla's hair, I, I literally find it everywhere. I don't know if you can even see it, but it's freaking on that. Good Lord, lady. Her hair falls out everywhere. Uh, thank you for telling me about the brand. No problem. All right, that's better. No hair on that one. Her hair is literally everywhere. You have the same problem? I, everywhere I go. I literally wake up in the morning and sometimes I have her hair on my face. I have to like wipe it off. I'm like, how do you still have hair in your head? It's all over the house. She sheds more than the damn dog does. Um, Ed, appreciate the, uh, appreciate the lightning bolts. I'm trying to sign up for auto posture, but it doesn't, uh, but it's not letting me do anything. Don't know if there's a, um, problem with auto posture. I don't know. Auto posture is working for me. It's, it's been relisting all day. Uh, reach out to auto posture on Instagram and tell her what's going on and she'll help you with it. She's really good at getting back, um, ASAP. So yeah, reach out to her on Instagram and send her a message and she'll probably be able to help you within the day. Uh, maybe it's a setting you have or something like that that she can help you through. Cause I didn't have any issues when I signed up, I was able to just hook up all my platforms. You just go on, sign up, hook up all your platforms and then it starts doing your things after you tell it what to do. Awesome, thanks, I really wanna start. Yeah, just reach out to her, she'll be able to help you with that. Um, or you can DM me and let me know what's going on and I, I might be able to help you with it too. Um, next sale is a really good one. What to, uh, What's a, what is typical sales pattern for December sales? Does it pick up right after Christmas? Um, so typical sales pattern for December, for those of you who this is your first December, um, you'll be getting sales up until about the 17th, 18th. Once the 17th, 18th hits, you're gonna get more sales, but they're gonna drop off. It's not gonna be like, if I'm averaging like 10 to 15 sales per day, it's probably gonna dip down to like five because people know they're not gonna get their items in time for Christmas. So people will still buy stuff, like normal stuff they're gonna buy, but they know it's not gonna get there before Christmas because 17th, 18th is the cutoff day for this year. And then right after Christmas, like um, 27th, 28th, you'll see it start picking back up again because that's when people get their Christmas money. So they get stuff in their stockings, they get stuff from their grandparents, their parents, um, their husbands, their spouses, they just give out money. Um, and then they start using that money on eBay. So then you'll see your sales start pick up and it, it's normally pretty good through January and February and the end of February, it starts falling off. March, April is when you start getting that summer slowdown. Um, how many listed items should I have before getting auto posture? I always tell people if you have a, over a hundred items, I think auto posture will be beneficial to you. If you have under a hundred items, you should be able to delist um, relist manually yourself and it shouldn't take you that long because you only have a hundred items. So you can do like whatever that would be three or four a day for a month and you should be able to get it done, which should take you like less than five minutes. Um, once you start getting over a hundred items, it'll be beneficial to you to have something else do it for you, especially if you sell on multiple platforms, eBay, Poshmark, and Mercari, because it does it for all three of those websites. Um, did you find, find that around January, people are going to be purchasing more ath um, athletic stuff? No, athletic stuff is when it starts getting warmer out. January, February, it's still, it's still kind of cold out. So you won't see that. You, you won't see like the polos, the, the, the athletic gear, the Lululemons start selling until like March, April. And you wanna have that stuff listed before the big rush. Same with right before Christmas or right before uh, winter, um, August, September, you wanna start listing your winter gear because October, November, December, that's when it starts selling. How much is auto posture? It's 35 bucks a month for the um, pro plan. Um, if you just want the Poshmark version, it's 25, but I have a link in my bio to sign up. You'll get $5 off your first month. So go use that code. They also have, she also has a free trial too. 
that works with auto pusher. Wayne ignoring me. No, I'm not ignoring you. I promise. I promise I'm not ignoring anybody. There's a lot of questions in the chat. Um, I would never ignore you, Turtle Kim, aka Posh Main, because you're you're one of one of my favorites in the chat. You might be my favorite in the chat right now. Um, because you've been here forever. Why does Kayla why does everyone have Kayla hair? Um, I don't know why everyone has Kayla hair. Everybody's hair keeps falling out of their heads. Even mine. That's why that's why I always wear a hat. Um, as your longest running subscriber, once again requesting a hanger remote. It's not happening. What cross luster um, do you use with auto posture? List perfectly. Again, I have a link in my bio for that as well. I'm going to talk about the sale and I'll get back to questions. I got a lot of time for questions today, chat, so feel free to hit me with a ton of them. Um, this is a Pendleton shirt. Shout out to everybody on that video that said Pendleton doesn't sell for more than $40. You are wrong. You are wrong. You are wrong. You are wrong. This is the third one that I've sold for just over 100 bucks. So this one sold with shipping. It sold 98 plus shipping. Um, I paid $37.45. If you're listing these for 40 bucks and they're selling instantly, there's a reason they're selling instantly. It's because you underpriced them. Um, so I've had this listed for just about a month and it's sold for $98 plus shipping for a Pendleton shirt. Size 2X. Nothing crazy. Which label maker do you recommend for newbies? I have one linked in my bio. If you go to my products I use on a daily basis, I have the label maker that I use up there. Um, do you pay for premium subscrip subscription for eBay pot? Um, are you talking about list perfectly? Cause there's no subscription for Poshmark and Mercari. Are you paying the premium subscription? Um, if you're talking about list perfectly, yes, I pay for the most expensive version. I, I don't know. Um, if you're talking about, um, Poshmark and Mercari, there's no subscription for those sites. This is going to go padded flat rate for $8 and 30 cents. Buyer paid 1180. The platform you make the most sales on, uh, right now the most volume is going to be whatnot. Um, if you're talking about eBay, Poshmark, Mercari, um, if you're not into live selling, eBay by far. I can tell you my numbers here in a second so you get a better idea of why. Best ways to ship um, a bulky hoodie, pad a flat rate envelope. Unless it's going close, then you're going to ship it in uh, ground advantage. You're just going to ship it in a regular envelope. Uh, please tell me the name again of the cross posting company you use, Auto Posture. Auto Posture does not cross post. It is a delister and a relister. So it keeps your items fresh. The cross lister I use is called List Perfectly. I have a link in my um, pin post on Facebook to sign up and you'll get $30 off your first month. That's the, uh, that's the cross lister that I use. Best label you use of the iPhone, mine is terrible. So if you need a Bluetooth one, don't buy the one in my bio. You're gonna have to do your own research. I um, Emily uses a Rolo. Rolo I've heard is really good. Um, they have a new Bluetooth version that came out like a year and a half ago. Um, so I would go with Rolo. Those are more expensive, but they're probably gonna be worth your worth your bang for your buck. I guess is what I'm trying to say. Kayla's back from the gym. Kayla's a responsible adult that goes to the gym. I, however, I'm not responsible by any means. I'm be fat, dumb, and happy. That's my goal. I'm gonna start going to the gym in the new year. I promise, chat. I'm gonna go in the new year because I'm gonna have more time. I use Rolo and it's great. Yeah, I've heard Rolo's good. I use a Dymo. I don't think Dymo has a Bluetooth version out yet, or if they do, it's the 5XL. It's pretty expensive, and I would never suggest the 5XL. And then what's the other one? Uh, Zebra. I think Zebra has a uh, Bluetooth thermal printer. I think. What's up, Mary? What's up, Tracy? I saw you sent lots of USPS envelopes and you said they shipped for free. Um, did I misunderstand? Yes, you can get USPS free packing supplies. If you go to USPS.com, um, you go to their shipping center, you have to create an account, go to their, um, not shipping, packaging center, and click the free option, and you can order as many as you want. Um, I think they put a limit on some, but you can just do multiple orders, and you can have as many as you want shipped to your house. USPS.com, free uh, packing, uh, packaging materials. All the boxes, these bags, these get ordered and delivered for free. I don't pay for any of those. Find what not to have excessive fees. What not fees are the least out of every platform. It's 8%. Um, funds are limited. Do you uh, recommend cross posting first or auto posture? Cross posting first. You're going to move your items to multiple platforms. And then after you do that, you have more chances for a sale, which will lead to more sales, which will lead to you being able to buy auto posture and other things like that. But cross posting is key. Um, I bought an off-brand label printer from Amazon. Works great. Yep, the, the one I have linked in my bio is called an IDPRT. It's also like an off-brand label printer. They're all pretty much the same thing. They have the same insides. They just have different names on the outside. So um, when do you need poly mailers? When you start selling stuff. Obviously, you need stuff to ship your items in. So if you're going to be listing a lot of clothing um, in the near future, I would suggest getting some poly mailers. 
I do work with a company, um, Gyropack, and I have 10% off code in my bio if you're watching this on Facebook and YouTube. I have a video on TikTok. It has all of them linked in the TikTok shop, and some of you are getting like 20%, 30%, $30 off, so on and so forth. Um, so go watch my video I put out the other day. Can you send me some money on my cash card? Wait, hold on. Can you send me some money on my cash card when my kids... Um, Kelly, are you really asking me to send you money right now? Kelly, what I'll, what I'll do is I'll teach you how to go to a thrift store and buy stuff and then resell it and you can make your own money. Um, for those with limited funds, Flip is free. Yep, Flip is a free cross or too. I've heard they've had a couple glitches um, recently. It's because they're free. Um, but some people lo- like it. So uh, feel free to use the, f- uh, the free ones too. Um, try them all out. Every one of them. Every one of them has a free option too. Um, when you list a solid black 2XL... What you list, is, you got to look up comps on that one. Solid black, it depends on um, if it's cotton, if it's solid black. I mean, it's probably a, a, like a sixty to eighty dollar flannel. Um, Thompson BJ, how much? Like that's what I said, sixty to eighty. Oh man, I was excited for the live thrift day. Yeah, no live thrift this morning. Um, we have too much inventory. We have too much inventory. Comps are all over the place, listed high. Flannels right now are selling like hotcakes. So can you send me some money um, too, please? Uh, Arizona, I will send you. Next time I see you on Whatnot, I'll tip you. You deserve it. You deserve it. All right, last sale um, is this train. I just listed this two days ago. I need to get all of these listed because they're selling very, very fast. Um, Mom's out this week, so uh, I, I next the following few weeks, I'm gonna be listing trains like crazy. Um, I paid three dollars and twenty-five cents each for these trains. This one sold for thirty dollars plus shipping. Thirty plus shipping on a train set or on a train, <clears throat> and that's just going to go in one of these boxes and ship out. Um, I do get duplicate um, using sometimes Auto Posture helps keep track of it. Yes, Auto Posture has a new feature. It's an inventory feature, so you can actually track all your duplicates, and you can also track if you like deleted a listing on eBay but forgot to do it on Poshmark. Auto Posture has that um, feature as well. So you'll be able to track all your inventory. Do you sell private coaching sessions? No, these are my coaching sessions. Ask any question you want, I will answer it for free. I don't do um, I don't do any of those things. I cannot figure out how to get my eBay to print four by six, um, have an IDPRT. So Ryan on the shipping page, right before you go to ship your order on the bottom right hand corner, it says, your label format. I can't show it on the screen because it's going to show my buyer's information. Bottom right hand corner, when you hit purchase shipping label, you're going to put in your information and then it's going to say um, format. Change your format to 4x6. Uh, what spreadsheet do you use to track? Um, Jason A spreadsheet, link in my pin post and also on my bios. You can um, get Jason's spreadsheet for 10% off if you use code KWAY shop. Um, I have a, I'm not an alcoholic, but for life, I cannot figure out how to. Damn, how to get how to use a damn tape gun? So I don't use a tape gun. I use this thing. I know a lot of people are like, you need to get a tape gun. This thing has been working perfectly forever. So I just bought one of these like duct tape rolls, and I've interchanged these over and over again. I've changed out the the label, so this has been working um, perfectly fine. I have a question. Uh, if I already have an eBay account but want to change my name to create a store, is that possible? You can create your change your name, but your URL will always be the same. So whatever you created your first account, your URL will always remain the same. How much do rubber gram button ups go for? It depends on the pattern, depends on the print, depends on the style, all that all that stuff. It's you can't just that's a very a solid solid blue will sell for a completely different price than an all over paisley print. And uh 100% silk one will sell for a completely different price than a 100% cotton one. Um so that really just depends. Um do you have to buy Jason's spreadsheet every year? You don't. You can use the same spreadsheet year after year. Um you can make copies of it. But I will say that every year he adds new things onto the spreadsheet that makes it more desirable. Every year I buy the new one. So this year he made a creator spreadsheet. So those of us that make videos and stuff and have like affiliates and all that stuff, we have ways to track that this year on that spreadsheet. So if you're in that boat too, there's a new spreadsheet from Jason. Um, Again, if you use my code, you save, I think it's 10% off, something like that. You get a discount if you use my code. I, I can't keep up with all that stuff. Um, the name of the program I use a cross post is list perfectly um, link in my pin post to uh, save yourself 30% off your first month man there's a lot of questions this is hard chat I'm going back and forth <laughs> um, how do you how do you know when to mail a poly mailer or a priority mail if it's over a pound I'll check to see if priority mail is cheaper 
then ground advantage. Ground advantage is when it goes into a polymailer. Um, who's Jason? Jason Hayes. He's on TikTok. He's on Facebook. He's on YouTube. Jason Hayes. Um, he's on my follower follower list. So if you go there and you just type in Jason, you'll find him. Um, he's he did um, he's doing a um, live with Line Creek I think today in the middle of the day about his spreadsheet. So go check that out. Um, how, how do I find how much an item is worth? Carla, what you do is you go on eBay, you type in the item you have in your hand, whatever descriptive words you need to use to find that item, and you're gonna filter for um, used or new, and you're gonna filter for sold. You're gonna see exactly um, what that item is selling for. When you cross post, do you have the same item? Do you have the same prices on the items? Typically, yes, I keep the same prices on my items. I have items on three platforms. How hard is it to import everything to AutoPosher? Um, it's not hard at all. You just hit import and it will pull all your listings as long as you have your items on there. But remember, AutoPosher is not a cross lister. It's a delister relister. So if you buy AutoPosher and you think you're going to be able to cross list, you're not going to be able to yet. She's coming out with one in quarter one, I guess, is when she um, wants to have the cross lister for AutoPosher out. Um, do you want to sound stupid, but what is a URL? Your URL is like when you type it into your search bar, that's your URL. Uh, or not your search bar. Like when you're going on Google and you type in google.com, that's a search, that's a URL. You're going to google.com. Um, so under a pound, a priority, no, under a pound equals ground advantage always. You'll, you'll, hard, you'll never ship priority mail under a pound. Ground advantage is always a pound, uh, under a pound. All right, let me wrap this up real quick and then I'll answer as many questions. I have to be off the live at 10.15 though. I have a, Something I have to do at 10.15, actually 10.30, so I gotta be off the live and prepared for it. Use stock photos? Nope, you'll never see any of my listings use stock photos. Not even like my new listings. The only ones you'll see maybe are the ones that, uh, like new in box shoes, sometimes eBay gives you the stock photo on your listing, but that's the only time you'll see a stock photo. I never, ever, ever use stock photos. Announcement today? No, not today. Uh, no, not today, not today. I'm meeting. I, I'm meeting with. Uh, I'm meeting with a company. Let's just put it that way. Today at 10:30, I have to be off the live. That's why I'm awake a little early today too. So it could be really good. It could be, yeah, not so good. We'll see. Um, this is. I just wrap this up in bubble and then put some packing material on top. I make sure it's a thick layer of bubble wrap, uh, wrap on it. And then this is an eBay, eBay 8x6x4 box. I get these free with my quarterly coupon. Should you round up when weighing safe? Yes. So if the item weighs 11.2 ounces, use 12 ounces. If the item weighs 1.2 pounds, you can go to 1.21 pounds. You can use 1.3 or you can round up to 2. Either way, you're going to be charged the same amount. All right. There we go. Nice and shipped. Shake test. Nothing's moving. That's exactly what you want to hear. You're going to throw that on the scale. It's going to weigh 11 ounces. And it is in a 10 by 8 by 6 box. 10 by 8 by 6. Buyer paid $6.40 to have this shipped. I'm only paying $4.88. Do you weigh before or after it's in a box? You weigh after. Because if you weigh before, you're only going to get the weight of your item. If you weigh after, you're going to get the weight of the item and the packaging materials that you're using, and that's what you need to be charged. Because if you just use the other weight and you end up being like a pound off because you use a big box with a lot of packaging material, you're going to be charged more. Peace out, Joel. Appreciate you stopping in. Joel's in the house. All right, that one's shipped. All right, if you have any questions, feel free to drop them. I'll go through and I'll blaze through these questions. And then I have to ship out my whatnot orders from yesterday. Appreciate everybody who came in. Um, Tuesday nights, by the way, um, not next Tuesday because we're taking next week off, but the following Tuesday, every single Tuesday, we're going to be doing a consignment unboxing. And I think if I, I have a couple consigners, I'm going to ask a couple of them if they could send me a list of what they want per item in their boxes. And I might have even more boxes to unbox. So last night we did two. I might potentially have three or four um, if I get everybody to send me a list of what they want. So um, appreciate everybody who came out yesterday. We sold some crazy stuff. This sold for 60 bucks yesterday. Like, and I'm pretty sure this would have sold for more than 60 bucks on one of my lives. But this is a LL Bean barn chore jacket. Really, really nice. Got the corduroy collar and that one went for 60 um, yesterday. And actually went for less because we made this person a deal. Shout out Crits. 
um, because they always come back and buy multiple things from us. So he got four items and then he got like $25 off too. At the end of winter, do you pull off all your winter clothes? No, I leave them listed because I, I use the international shipping program. So there's potential for me to be able to sell overseas. Um, so when it's hot here, it's cold there. So um, I leave it all listed. I have all my summer stuff currently listed too. I don't, I don't take that down. Um, I thought you had a male priority if it's over a pound weight. No, you can use ground advantage up to 70 pounds. Same with priority. So if one's cheaper, I always set my listings normally to ground advantage because it's normally the cheapest. But if it ever is cheaper to ship priority, I'll change it to priority because that's actually you upgrading the label. If you go from ground, you're upgrading. If you go from down from priority to ground, you're downgrading. You can't normally do that. You can, but sometimes it ends up getting there late. To avoid weighing each items, do you have a set amount? Yes. So Sav, I, uh, saving, uh, saving mom. I want to call you Sav. Um, so for shirts, I normally do use 10 ounces. Unless it's like a heavier flannel, I'll do 15 ounces and I'll charge it to the customer. Um, when you first start though, I always suggest you just weigh everything out. It, that way you don't make any mistakes. Um, I start listing spring items. Um, I'm using the surf's up method now. So I'm gonna start uh, listing spring items in February, March. Probably February. Can you use any box for priority? Yes, 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 yes. Um, you can't use any box for ground advantage though. So ground advantage, you're not allowed to use one of the free priority boxes. But with priority, you can use any priority mail box as long as you use it appropriately with the label you're buying. And um, you can use any like brown box. You just weigh it and ship it out. So um, let me see how many orders did I say I have? I have five over here. Okay. That shouldn't take too long to ship out. Kayla's probably taking a shower right now because she, like I said, she's a responsible adult. So she went to the gym. Um, do you measure your box sizes and weigh for um, each app? Poshmark um, and Mercari, I don't because Mercari, I get my labels off of Pirate Ship. So I do that afterwards. Poshmark, I never weigh or measure anything because as long as it's under five pounds, you can ship it in pretty much any box. eBay, I do after, I, um, after the item sells. By the way, just keep quit my overtime and my work now since we're selling working 40 hours now instead of 60 hours. Tam, let's go. Tam, I remember when I did that for the post office. I went on, um, there's an overtime list and then there's a regular, um, like regular scheduled list, eight hour day. And I changed from, from six, like the overtime list where I was working like 60, 70 hours um, to the regular list. And everybody was like, what are you doing? Like, I thought you loved overtime. I'm like, I do, but I'm making more money selling online. So I might as well do that. And then it just took off from there. So you're going to see a big difference in your business. Kayla's not pregnant. It's impossible because if she is, that baby isn't mine. I'm, I'm, yeah, that baby ain't mine. Um, why aren't you shopping today? Because we have too much stuff and mom's out this week. So we have to um, keep up with business. So we opted not to um, We opted not to go shopping this week. I'm probably going shopping next week though. Probably. Um, I'm using free shipping on Mercari and offering pirate ship, correct. I might change it over to the new label format because everything under 12 ounces is actually shipping out for a decent price. I think it's like $5.99. So we'll we'll see if I see if I change things over. What's up, mom? I'm excited uh, to see the growth. Uh, you guys helped me so much. Appreciate it. But you're the one doing the work, not us. We're just we're just here helping answering questions. What's up? I'm on live. You're awake early. I am awake early. That's because we have that thing at, at 10.30, so I had to get up early. And I only have four orders. Oh. And, then, and then these. Did you go to the gym? I did, and then I went to Target to get your Christmas present, and then I figured while I was there, and I didn't have children, I would get like their stocking stuffers and stuff and finish up Christmas. That's what happens when you go to Target, chat. You go I to went Target. for apple juice and a Christmas <laughs> present and came out $100 later <laughs> with stocking she stuffers. And apple and juice and a Christmas <laughs> present. She came out. On, you know. Everybody's saying hi to you. Hello. All right, chat. I'm going to go ahead and head off. Um, I might be live later tonight. Um, we'll see. I might be live later tonight. Just make sure you're following. You'll get a notification as soon as I go live. If I do, I'll just hang out for like 30 minutes and just chat and probably do some cross-listing and stuff like that. So um, 
Appreciate you guys hanging out. Um, I am loading both whatnot shows today too. That's what I'm going to be working on pretty much the whole day. Get caught up with that. So I'm not doing it on Friday and Saturday. Those shows are loaded, so go bookmark them. We're going to have some crazy stuff. Um, some stuff is already on those racks. And if you came to my whatnot show last night, the consignment unboxing, you've seen all the sh all the items that are coming, and you've seen the items that are um, pretty much loaded, ready to be loaded into the show. So we have some really, really crazy stuff. So make sure you come out. It's going to be a lot of fun. Bookmark those shows. If you haven't signed up for whatnot, link in my bio, get your $15 to spend absolutely free. Um, that is linked in my bio. So if you want free money, they're linked. If you're watching on Facebook, um, it's in my pen post. So appreciate you guys hanging out and I'll catch you on the next one.